Cool. Yeah. Holy Jane Paul. <laughs> <laughs> Does that have a laser in it and everything? Yeah. <laughs> no, like that would be. I saw a lightsaber. Oh, yeah. oh boy. Yeah. Oh boy. The chickens definitely came home to roost. Um, who needs a daughter like that? Right? <laughs> uh, okay, so I denied the fact she was my daughter for a while, but you know, get over it. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's, 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 yeah, it's basically, uh, just kind of left hanging there now, it's kind of, um, yeah, you'll, you'll, you'll see in the, uh, in the trailer, it's, it's, it's basic sort of theme of, of madness from George, who rules when the king is unable to. Yeah, um, there, there were a couple of, there was a, there was a, the, the, uh, the tournament that basically after basically proved that he was a, he was a king. Um, and it was nice the fact that you know they they gave Uther the power to to, um, to recognize and to you know, just doff his cap. You're there. Well, as I say, it's, it's about the madness of King George. It's like, you know, where, what, and he's ready, but, you know, and the king is, is um, not, not there, you know what I mean? Um, so what happens? It's, it's, it, it messes with the equilibrium, creates a vacuum. So, uh, and Morgana, she's just bad. <laughs> Getting better. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thankful that I wasn't in Camelot. I'd have died in the first episode. <laughs> um, no, it's you know the bottom line is, as I say, you can you, you can mess with it, right. uh, and they do they mess with, with kind of people's general concept of the, of the legend. The legend sort of is kind of out. Out there. Right. And, and uh, you know, the first, first two seasons, people, you know, purists were going, how can we do this to, you know, to a legend that is sort of deeply in the British consciousness? Well, they've got over it. And if they're, if they're not watching, then, you know, bye-bye. Um, yeah. There are enough people now watching who are just, just enjoying good storytelling. Yeah. Uh, and uh, that storytelling can lead lead the writers where they want to go. They're not sort of bound by um, by the laws of the legend. Right. It's cool. Excellent. Good. Because we like having you around. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, except, I mean, what, what was what really fun in, in season three was the fact that, you know, magic's bad and Will you use some magic when I need you to? Like, it's quite fun. <laughs> um, basically, the fact that he's a big hypocrite. It's, it's, always, it's always good fun <laughs> to play. Um, no, I mean you had to establish, um, you had to establish his in, entrenched point of view uh, in order to be able to do it. And so, seasons one and two, he was, you know, became more and more entrenched. But I, I mean. For some time, I've been playing that um, when you have a limited box of tools, you know, you've got a hammer and a wrench, and that's it. And, you know, when you have to tackle the more intricate jobs, um, <laughs> kind of budget, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, there's a very sweet, there's a focus puller, uh, second, second camera, camera operator, and, and every time Luther makes one of his classically bad um, decisions, he says, ah, oh, where you go? <laughs> 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 you know it, you know it's going to come back and bite it. <laughs> the, the thing that the boys of, of it, Johnny and Junior have always been extremely open, mm. sort of making um, Richard and myself, we've always been able to do stuff outside. So, um, they've been very generous uh, with our time. Um, so, um, not necessarily, uh, you know, we sort of work around the schedule and it's, uh, it's, 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 it's very refreshing to be open-minded producers now. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.
stating the obvious. I said obvious. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. It's good. It's great. It's great. It never ceases to amaze me the power of the power of that is. It makes it extraordinary. It, it's kind of part of the ethos. It really is. It's not like it's not like one of those TV shows that sort of people are. You know, it's, it's like it really is to, because it was such great writing. It's such great writing. Uh, it's it's lived on. And there's, what's very exciting is there's a whole generation of producers who came up as writers who hold it in great sense. They revere it greatly. And so it's nice to go into a producer's office and do the child. It's like, yeah. <laughs> I didn't get to play it. It was done in a comic book. I know how to come to the You're bummed that you didn't get to play it. Uh, you know, bottom line is, especially, you know, in, jo in, in Joss's universe, I mean, uh, I think, you know, it, it received the seven seasons when it was, it basically left the land when it should have. And I think the idea of sort of, of having a season eight in a comic book is, is, is genius. And he's got you know, some of the best writers of have, have extended and have given given it a longevity. Because one of the things that we were talking about a long long time ago was was, a, was a, an animated series. And it, it, it got it got screwed with. Um, and one of the reasons that you know I was very sad about that was because you can go places in an animated series that you can't in a live action series. Um, unless you well, I was going to say unless you go into a serious um, computer graphics land. But ultimately, where else if you can't do an animated series, then the, the comic book makes makes such sense. Because, you know, it, it can get bigger. It can go. There was one story I know, in the comic book with. with <laughs> anyway, I would love to have played that moment, but the bottom line is, you know, it's, it's, if it's going to be out there, it's, it's good that it's in comic book. The only thing was that Josh didn't get to tell me. He was beaten to it by one of the editors of Dark Horse. He said, did Josh tell you what he's done? I thought, I thought I was going to get a promotion or something. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he killed you. <laughs> and then Josh literally peered over his shoulder and went, you told him? <laughs> no. <laughs> I was going to tell him, but I'm going to break it gently. <laughs> but anyway, that's cool. It's all good. It's all good. You've been reading the comics, though. Yeah. Wow. Dipped in and out. I have wow. uh, And I have. I've seen my dad. Mm. How many people can say that? Yeah. <laughs> Everywhere you go, you got to go. Oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Repo, I mean, you know, whether you love it or hate it, you know, Repo yeah. is a huge, huge yeah. problem. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. Thank you.